Hello everybody, it's the Warm, back again for Raging Loop. Last time, a bit of a smaller episode. It was a bit of a, it was pretty much just one major decision, and then the very quick consequences of said decision, and uh, then we kind of just sped up toward the, the next feast very quickly, and now here we are. So, obviously, um, <laughs> I didn't want to jump into a whole feast because usually these are pretty in-depth and there's a lot to talk about and, you know, all that sort of stuff. So, this should be a nice long one. And um, there's a lot to consider, really, because last time we went ahead and fulfilled our promise to Kaori and we targeted her sons. In particular, I chose to go for Yoshitsugu, the crow. Unfortunately, uh, that whole process, plus Haruaki's behavior in the moments leading up to that event, caused Kaori to break. You know, we had, we've seen this before with her. And she went, and went ahead and killed Yasunaga as well. So... Currently, she's, uh, she's likely to be targeted by corruption. Uh, that's going to that's gonna be in everyone's mind going forward. Hashimoto-san will make sure we don't forget that, I'm sh you know. Um, and unfortunately for us, Kaori also admitted, essentially admitted to being a wolf. She didn't directly say that, but she might as well have. Um... She said she was under the influence of the Yamatsu Okami, and thus, you know, with with Tai, she know she knew what that meant. Um, so now we're in a bit of a well, we're in a bit of a pickle, I guess, because all of that uh, last time I believe it was stated that all that remains of the authority amongst our survivors here it's going to be Haruaki, Hashimoto, and Kyo. Kinosuke. And I'm pretty dang sure that Hashimoto is suspicious of us by this point. So, um, Kyo is definitely not, I don't think he's as big an obstacle as, say, Yasunaga or Kanzo is. So, I really feel like Hashimoto is now going to have his opportunity to really run things the way he wants to run it. And that is obviously not so good for us. <clears throat> we, I know we as wolves, that being Haru and uh, Haruaki, we haven't really had a lot of time to make a plan for this. So I'm not sure what the, uh, I'm not sure what the strategy is going into this. I know there was a moment um, where. Haruaki mentioned something about uh, Yoshitsugu and the state of his corpse, and that could be something that gives us away. I'm not sure. It was kind of vague. We had a little talk about this in the comments. It was kind of vague whether or not Haruaki was given a description of Yoshitsugu or not. And so he, at one point, he mentioned, you know, the state of uh, Yoshitsugu's corpse. So. We're going to have to see if that's something Haruaki gets called out on, or if that's just... If it doesn't come up again, then obviously they gave him a rundown. So, yeah. Um, yeah, it was pre yeah, pretty heavy last time, all things considered. Haruaki definitely sort of... <laughs> acknowledging how he's, you know, pretty much becoming a villain at this point. So... Uh, we'll just have to see how that continues. All right, let's uh, let's start here. Let's have a tie bring us in. Sakazuki ga mawatta. Utage o hajime yo ka ne. Okay. Hashimoto shi no. Sakki no tsuzuki o ukagaitai ne. Are kara kangaetan desu ga. この中に狼が 
ロサイシ君がヘビでマキシマハルさんが人そしてメイコちゃんが多分無事な Yes, that was also, I forgot to mention,、uh, Haruaki did try to go for, would not try, he, he made a play. He claimed that Haru, our fellow wolf, is a human. So we'll just, we're just going to have to see whether that was the right decision or not. Poor Mako. Oh. <laughs>、uh... こりゃ狼は大変だろうなどうだろうね小さい子だからみんな処刑をためらう狼から見れば失いにくい一票キープだよ彼女は I do find it interesting that even if she's not good at it I mean this seems to show to me that she understands Her role and is trying to fulfill it. You know, that's, that's interesting to me. The fact that Mako understands that she's, she's playing for a team, you know?、Uh, that's, that's interesting. So, obviously, now that it's basically that Kaori admitted that she was a wolf, Mako's trying to, <laughs> you know, in her own way, help her, even if it's not that good. Yeah. まあ僕としても彼女を殺す気はないけどね人が勝てれば彼女も死ななくていいんだろうしねえそれはともかくこれは失礼とにかくこの場で正体が確定してないのは山脇さん野里さん、植松さん、それに Q ちゃん。Um, one more thing about Mako. I think we've been, we, we, it was mentioned in the comments. I'm not sure if I responded to it. Maybe I did. I can't remember.、Uh, but at one point, Mako claimed she was a goat or something.、Um, it, I think it was a few episodes back. And. I think I did respond to it in the comments, yeah. But I don't think I've ever addressed it in an episode.、Um, but it's very strange that it was surprising to me that she called herself a goat and not a sheep. And I'm very curious as to what that might mean, considering I've been assuming that the sheep is the one responsible for our looping. And if Mako's not the sheep, then who is? Yeah. Don't know. Who are these people? Who are these people? Here we go. Ano, Hashimoto san. あんまりもったいぶらずにもったいぶってるわけじゃないんだ実のところこれは違和感に過ぎないただの感想だからそれで誰かに容疑をかけるとなれば慎重にもなるよねさて織部さんがおっしゃっていたことを僕は結構重視していて彼女はどうやら善意で殺人を行っているようだバカなことをバカなことですか皆さんと同じですねと僕は続けたかったんですがどこが同じなもんかいね狼は読み人の棟梁よ。汚れと恨みで人を殺す。いやいや、そうじゃなくて、皆さんがくくると呼んでいる処刑のことです。あれをやったら救われるっていう考え方なんでしょ狼に殺されるよりは
あっちの方がマシとそりゃあそうよねそうやってご自分の側の殺人行為をおためごかして正当化している点は同じなんですよ狼もよその方にはわからんちょ橋本さんそれ本来は私の役じゃないですかいいんですか失礼とにかく織部かおりさんは息子のために早く殺してあげたかったという思考で動いていてである以上彼女は当然真っ先に息子を殺してあげたかったと考えられるわけです何しろ今日の夜を待てずに安永君を殺してしまうほどだ捨て身でね気になるんだよねなぜ最初の死人が安永君でなかったかというところが Well, because I thought that Yasunaga could be protected by the spider. That's, that's why I chose. Sai Shoni Shindano was Serizawadaga. Arega Okami no Shiwaza de Nainara. Muro no Kotoka. Eh, eh. Muro Takumi san des. Takumi. Doshite. そんなに妙ですか彼は常に話し合いの中心にいましたからそこを崩そうとしたんじゃそれも確かだけど織部さんはとにかく息子2人を殺してあげたいという気持ちだったろうしそう主張したと思うんだそれなら安永君を殺すのでも結構オオカミとしてはありだと思うんだよね He had a point If we kill Yasunaga kun There was a good chance of us throwing the feast into emotional and conservative chaos Which meant that Hashimoto-san's argument was なぜ狼は織部さんの意見を却下してまで室さんを狙ったんだろうね Because we knew something about Takumi, of course. So, no toki wa mada kaori san wa koroshi ni sonna ni kodawatte na kattan ja. So da ne, sore mo zero ja nai. Tada, yori ari so na no wa. Shonichi no kikai o Serizawa san ni ubaware. Futsuka me no satsujin mo kakka sareta koto de. Oitsume rareta. 彼女の暴走 Shit. How do you know? どうしてそれがよりありそうだと彼女は自分がオオカミの加護者だと要はオオカミだってことでいいんでしょうがそれを自ら口にしましたでしょ Moshi kono sawagi ga Hoka no okami no shoudaku no moto Neratte oko sareta mono nara Ore wa zettai iwanai hou ga ii Fushi kun mo sakki Fusai shi kun ga ii dashita Tan ni ki ga furete koto ni oyon da ってぎわく Are o ii hareru kara ne 彼女がただの狂人のふりをしてれば僕らは今頃もっと悩むことになっていたでしょうねなるほどうーんーとつまりムロさんの死までは狼側の計画通りだったけど織部かおりさんは承服していなかっただから今回の騒ぎを起こしたってことですよねこれがどう広がりますつまりムロさんを殺害することを主張し昨日まではそれでオオカミを統制していたにもかかわらず今日手綱を失った
そんなオオカミがさっきの4人の中にいることになるんだけど正直ピンときませんすみませんこれはある意味で皆さんに人の上に立つ力がないように見えるという悪口になってしまう、うん、しかしまず女性だここの奥ゆかしい女性がある程度妥当性もあるオリベさんの提案をわざわざ蹴る気がしない山脇さんはご年配だから力関係は上かもしれないがそれであえて強権的に匠さんを一番に殺すかな絶対にせんわよそんなことそれは詭弁でしょう香織さんが最愛の息子を早く殺すことにこだわった以上同じことになってもおかしくないどどうしたのよ急にこの人は僕に疑いをかけようとしているハロワキ、kind of preempting the accusation here。ロサイシ君は黙っていてくれないかな ?I had to stop him.I had to stop him from swaying everyone's hearts. ノサトさんについては、おそらく、ヤスミズ住人との不仲から、そういった連携はうまく取れないんじゃないかと。てな決めつけだ香織さんは場の調和を重視する女性で清之助さんに最初だけ従っただけかもしれない少々思うところもあるがまあそうだろうなそれに私ならば室より安永君を優先して排除する案に同意しただろうそしてキュウちゃんについては言うに及ばずよそ者の主張をあなた方が聞くとは思えないまあそうでしょうねそれに私リーダー気質じゃありませんからということはオオカミのリーダーはこの中にはいないおかしいなこれまで確定扱いにしていたところに何か嘘があるんじゃないかなそんな必然的に自己申告に過ぎない蛇のカゴ者がオオカミそういう想像いや妄想したってことですよね気づいてるかいフサイシ君君は今日妙に発言が少ない発言するときは全部僕に難癖をつけるときだけだ自分に濡れ着ぬ着せようとしている人に食ってかかるのは当然でしょうちょやめようよ言うならあなたも随分イライラして見えますけど橋本さんだって不自然じゃないうん残念ながら僕はいくら不自然でもオオカミじゃないんだ猿だからねそしてうん僕はイライラしてるね Yep, <clears throat> so looking like a bad end here. Because obviously, not only do, are we getting cornered, but Haru would, I mean, you know, we, we cleared her, so once we go down, she's going to go down too. Tokushuna Haike no Moto, Horoshi Atter, Hitotachi Nara, Capo Yuzutte, Sotto Ste Oko, to Omoana Kumo Naiga. よそから潜り込んだ誰かさんがここの事情に悪乗りして狡猾に殺人をしてるってのは胸くそが悪すぎるからね。Look at this. Look at this. I'm disappointed in you face from Hashimoto here. だからそれはあんたの妄想だって言ってるんだ僕が凶悪で狡猾な人間だという勝手な前提に基づいた第一あんたは言ってるでしょうがよそ者は狼を率いることはできないと
パートナーだか愛人だか知らないがマミヤさんをかばって僕を非難するダブルスタンダードもいいところだは聞き捨てならないんだけどあんたふざけてんのまあその可能性もなくはないが違いますよ私は橋本さんとは何もないですグッ It was a huge risk, but now I'd cast doubt on Hashimoto san's side. Now, I just had to press them some more and. Kimi wa mo yoso mono janai. Hoko no jurunin toste mukai rare te iru. Soko kara ste. Kimi wa kokatsu sa o hakki ste ita yo ni omo ne. Goin ni shin jurunin to nari. Pai te gen no shin lai o eta. Tsube te ito te kikai? そうやって堂々とヘビを名乗る肝っ玉と口先があれば堀部さんをつかの間言いくるめることもできたかもねもっとも最後まで言いくるめることはできなかったようだけどああこれは信頼感が足りなかったかなご愁傷様だきっと君ならばどこかで匠さんあたりがヘビだったと気づいて始末する決断も下せたことだろうねそもそも君はどこの誰なんだいなぜこの集落に潜り込んだ事情を全て知ってるんじゃないか His verbal assault was entirely based on speculation, but it was a well crafted story. だから全部が全部推測じゃないか。Of course it was. Because it was the story I had actually put together. His deductions just happened to be right on the money, that was all. じゃあ、推測でないことを言おうか。あるならば言ってくださいよ。なぜ知っていた Oh, is this what we. Is this what we said last time? は昨夜の犠牲者が織部義継君だったのは消去法で分かったのかもしれないが。I think it was、uh, Danzy I was talking with. Yeah, so this is the.、Um, this is what we were talking about. And. Because it seemed a bit. It seemed a bit vague. Like they left it open as to whether or not. Because he went down there and he saw the situation with Kaori. He helped. Hashimoto tie, tie her up and all that stuff, and it was kind of just. There were a few lines where it says he got caught up on the situation of what was going on. And then there was a line where、uh, Haruaki says something like, Oh,、well, maybe it was the state of Yoshitsugu that caused her to go crazy. And then they just left it at that. So it does look like that was. Um, it does look like it is the case. Sorry. It does look like it was the case that no one told Haruaki that Yoshitsugu was the other victim. So. Yeah. <clears throat> so, good call on that. Yep. 彼の死体のありさまをなぜ君が知っていたのかな yeah, that particular point. That particular point. 君は知らないかもしれないが君が起きてくるずっと前に遺体は片付けてしまっているんだ Did they say that directly? They might have. I don't remember them saying that directly. ちょっとその時の経緯を知らないんですが香織さんは本当に狼なんですか義次君があんなひどいことになって取り乱した彼女が安永君を殺しただけってことは Yeah, so I mean this seems to imply that someone told him that you know Yoshitsugu got killed it's just they didn't go into the details At least that's what Hashimoto is saying here. I'd 
said something a wolf couldn't have known? Nano Kotodeska. So dane. Tobo Kerus Chica de Kina, ne? Nano Kotoka, Hunki de Wakarana in this. So na, Moso de. Oh, so ka. Set Tokuryoko no ar Kasetskawa. Boko ya Kimiga Kimeru Kotoja na ina. Just then, everyone stared daggers at me. Oh, Hyoni. Ikimashoka. I'd. I'd been completely defeated. Sore demo Bokuba. Okami Shanai. Naturally, everyone voted to hang me. Haruchan voted for me too, as she was right to. Cleaving off the lizard's tail was a good choice. She didn't need words to cover for me with. At any rate, two wolves had been eliminated in the same day. This was all Kauriori's fault. Was that the way I should think? Or should I think that I'd handled her the wrong way? Seriously, was there a way for the wolves to achieve victory here? Was there a way to step over that brilliant cameraman's corpse and press onwards? I felt like I was playing a troll game designed to be impossible to win. I continued to lament the absurdity of my situation until the very moment my consciousness sunk into the mist. Bad end. 25. Okay, sheep, haven't seen you in a while. Let me have it. やっつまったな大将。橋本雄大に完全 展開としてはすげえゴリッキーではあるが、6、安北の9、島釣り選択2で、もう一つの選択肢を選ぶ必要がある。それで起きることは明らかに狼としてはマイナスなことなんだが、今回に限ってはそれがプラスに働く。まあ
二人で手を下してください昨日やりすぎたから土壇場で後ろから刺されるのはごめんだからだよそんなことしないわよでもまあわかるからいいわ徹底的にやってくださいねそれは僕らの痕跡が残ったりメッセージを残されたりすることを防ぐためです説明の後なら苦しめることもないでしょう分かったわならないで。Suffer. I filled the bucket with water again and we went into the mist. The water from the faucet repelled the corruption just fine, though it was from a well, so maybe it didn't count as tap water. Haruchan went in front and Kaori san was right behind her. Haruchan was waving around the flashlight. Haruchan wa ayu no ga suki ne. Who cared about that? We headed for the door. Not long after, we arrived. This reminded me of the first night when we tried to kill him, and Chami got in our way. This time, it was something else. What happened? Hurry up. Open the door. I don't know. What? Huh? 私もやってみる他の部屋はどうかしら I tried touching the cheap looking metallic knob too I didn't feel anything unlocked so I couldn't open it either We then went around to all the houses that had living people in them but none of the doors opened After a moment of thought I reached a conclusion The spider had got the better of us Hey! Well, you know, I'm glad I was able to guess something right. Well, something right, but not good for us. Yeah, so turns out my choice to go for Yoshitsugu was technically correct. It's just that, uh, well, we kind of fumbled the execution a bit. What with Kaori going on a, you know, a rampage and then. Haruaki accidentally saying something he shouldn't. So, hey, but、uh, yeah, I'm glad I was able to understand this at least. How about that? So, Mari, Kumo and Nichan no doa o mamote te, so they do at a siraga doa o sawata shunkan, kagiake o fuseida. It's interesting how the supernatural rules here, it's such that. The spider picks a person, and then I guess the rules of the system of whatever we're doing here can detect when we try to open that door, and then we can't open any other door. That's, that's fascinating. So, yeah. I'm sure I would have,、uh, if I had picked this first, I would have thought this was a bad end or something on the horizon. But I guess not. あの状況で安水住人ならば安永君が一番重要な椅子に座ったことを理解して彼を守るどうすればいいのどうもこうも感受するしかありません僕らは一晩無駄にした香織さんは息子を殺せないそして雲には僕らが安永君を狙ったことがバレる So, will Kaori go on another rampage? I guess we'll just see. So, what is it? I'm not sure. Yeah, oh, it's me. Sorry. I'm not sure. I'm not sure. I'm not sure. For me, it's interesting because, well, maybe he'll say it, but let me try to, let me try to reason out some things. What's interesting to me is that the spider chose to protect Yasunaga. That does make sense.、Um, but they chose him over the snake. You know? I find that somewhat interesting. Hmm. The spider was from Yasumizu. If Mamiya san was the spider, 
She'd have protected either Hashimoto-san, me, or Yoshitsuku-kun. Ah, I see. Yeah, so partially my understanding. Because she knows at least that Yoshitsugu has a guardian. The only locals whose roles we didn't know were Tai-san, Kinosuke, Shi, and Rakako-san. Yasunaku-kun couldn't have been the spider since they couldn't protect themselves. Mako couldn't be, be, be it either, so... Excuse me. Mako couldn't be it either. If she was the spider, Rakako-san would control her like last time. She was clearly the badger. That meant that one of those three was the spider. It wasn't completely unlikely that it was Kinosuke Shi, but I couldn't imagine him making this choice. He'd pr probably protect Rakako-san every single day. In order of likelihood, from highest to lowest, it was probably Rakako-san, then Tai-san, then Kinosuke Shi. Worse than that. <laughs> This woman had abandoned all hope to keep her mind intact. That now came back around to undermine her sanity if she didn't get to kill her sons. And it looked like the situation where we couldn't let her have the kills she was promised would continue. Ooh, I didn't read that very well. Let me try again. And it looked like the situation where we couldn't let her... Sorry. Um, and it looked like the situation where we couldn't let her have the kill she was promised would continue. Sorry about that. Oh man, I wanted to reset. Right now, actually. <laughs> Maybe I could just walk off a cliff and... <laughs> what, my thoughts are funny to you? Hmm? <laughs> I was about to say, uh, you know we're not alone here, right? Kaori's here. Ah, <laughs> So this is something we talked about last time, too. Um, we, if we recall, there was a minor moment last time where the god in Haru decided to talk with us. And as part of that discussion, little discussion, it wasn't very long, um, Haru seemed to have a line in the middle of it. Now, of course, that raises the question of, well, what does that mean? Is it just the god mimicking Haru's voice in, a t in an attempt to throw us off? Or maybe the, the border between the god and Haru is a bit more unclear than we previously thought, you know, maybe there are um, a bit closer uh, than we think. Um, I will say, however, do you, let us recall, during Wit, after Haru gets killed in Wit, we still hear that god. So the god can exist independently from Haru, but um, I think the overall opinion that seemed most likely to me is that it was the god mimicking Haru's voice. And so that raises an interesting idea that pretty much any time we're talking to Haru, we could actually just be talking to the god. You know, she and I think it'd be fair just to assume that, considering, you know, the god's gonna be what has been watching and observing us. So this could just be, you know, I mean we heard her laugh. So we could just be talking to the god right now, not Haru, is basically what to, what we should be keeping in mind at times. I told the others to, if they were in danger of getting hanged, to pretend to be the spider and the crow. Uh, blah, blah, blah. That's just, that is not what was written here. I told the others to, if they were in danger of being, getting hanged, pretend to be the crow, avoiding the spider at all costs. The spider wasn't an option. Claiming the spider meant death on the next or following night, and if that didn't happen, it would mean that the spider was a fake. 
With Yoshitsuke-kun's reveal, pretending to be the crow became a lot harder, but it was still safer than pretending to be a spider. Yasunaga-kun and Hashimoto-san would also find it suspicious that a spider reveal even happened in the first place, so that was another reason. Though, I would follow Yasunaga-kun's idea and tell everyone that my snake powers said that Haruchan was a human, so she wouldn't be suspected. I was in way more danger in that regard. Also, I would see how the votes worked out, and, if possible, hang Rokako-san. However, our votes would go different ways. We couldn't force it. Tomorrow's vote would be on hanging one of the six unconfirmed humans. Tai-san, Kaori-san, Kinoskishi, Rokako-san, Meiko, and Mamiya-san. I would try to make it sure it wasn't Kaori. After I provided that course of action, we went our separate ways. We said goodbye to Kaori-san and went uphill. Oh my goodness. Look at this here. We gonna have a chat or no? Haru-chan. Nani? I was the one who started the conversation. That was a loss for me. She had a point. Another loss for me. Kamisama. Nanja? Machino Kata. Okua. Kurutirundiska. Kokoni Sai Shuni Oideni Natta Kuro. Kisamawa. Yarino Stamini Shino. Nado to Kanga Riona Gojin de Ottaka. Well, probably not, but I mean, I feel like that's more a consequence of the looping rather than Haraki himself, right? Ma, Kishte Zenin to you, Akedeva, Arasedarenka, the Yosega. That wasn't fair. Third loss. Dakara Zembu, Yasumi's Gawaru in this yo. Waruka Tawane, Soredemo. <laughs> I think he's saying trying to have a proper conversation since it's he's talking to two separate people here and one of them is not aware of the other. Anosa Nani Hontoni Kanzo san no koto. なんとも思ってないのなんとも思ってないわけないじゃないオリベ兄弟のことももっちのことも誰も殺したくないよじゃあどうして平気で振る舞うのそうするのが正しいからかな正しい正しい Crazy. Right. State of being. If that were the case, I could understand it. But, no. Even then, some things wouldn't make sense. No, that wasn't right either. It wasn't that I couldn't understand. It was just so absurd and way too hopeless. But... I wanted to tear off all these masks and examine them to my heart's content. There was no more terrifying or thrilling moment than the one when you were about to expose the ugly face of the unknown. 
and apparently the role of a wolf wasn't fit for this. The wolves were raped to right. Basically, I had to change my line of thinking. Haru-chan, I turned back to the small wolf. Nanyo. All right, it was Haru-chan. <laughs> she tilted her head in confusion. なぜなら僕らが超悪いからであって正しいからじゃない。悪役悪。そんなのいいの。よくはないさ。もちろん。でも知ってるか、ハルちゃん。人間ってのはやろうと思えば悪いことができる生き物なんだぜ。人殺しは悪いこと。もちろん悪だよ。友達や家族やいい人たちを殺すことは。輪をかけて最悪だね。Reasons why we shouldn't murder. It was perhaps the hardest topic in morality. However, when you thought about it, it wasn't too difficult to find a logical answer to that, too. You simply ignored the concept of good and evil. If ignoring such ideas was an integral part of being evil, then I would teach her, and through it, pose her a question. But how flexible she really was. Kokoroya Karadaga Fujiu ni Narukarasa Yokua Karanai Hitono Yagar Koto Sreba Hitokara Yagararu Sorewa Omo Ijoni Kokoro Shibari Tsker Hitoga Hidok Yagar Koto Sreshtoa Karadadate Shibari Tskerareru Shibarate 不自由な人は安心して生きられないし安心して死ねないんだ人間は誰しも悪くない生き方を良い生き方を誰かから強いられるそれはお互いに安心して生きて安心して死にたいから誰かが誰かを縛ったり縛られたり仕始めればそれは連鎖的にすごい数の人を不自由にしてしまうだからみんなそんな生き方は嫌でしょってことでよく生きろって育てられるんだよでもねはるちゃんそういうのを全部諦めれば周りを全部不自由にして自分も不自由な人生を送り不自由な最後迎えることを心に決めるなら人間は悪いことをやっていいんだねえそれって外だとみんなそうやって習うのいや今考えた出任せさひどでも案外正解かもしれないぜ君が賛同するなら僕も付き合うとことん悪に生きてやろうじゃないか私テレビでやってる洋画劇場好きでさへえ何が好きなのあのフォースがどうってやつ She really did love that series, huh? どのキャラが好き? キンピカのやつ Hmm. Was that why she liked androids? 
Did I remind her of him? ああいうのってさ、基本正義の側の気持ちで見るじゃん。私も言ったら恥ずかしいけど、かっこいいナイトが助けに来てくれたら素敵だななんてさ。とても真っ当な楽しみ方じゃないか。悪い奴になるなん
I just remembered that the protagonist of that movie was actually the princess's brother. Wait, but then it took a turn where the princess got together with a wandering rogue. Huh. Maybe it was safer to let her call me Nichan. <laughs> okay. Um, hmm. Well, we're definitely calling it there. Um... That's going to take uh that's going to take more than one read through there. Um definitely. So that w there was a lot in that conversation just now. Definitely a lot. And I'll be interested to hear your thoughts on it. First impressions though. Um Obviously not all of that conversation was good intentions but it seems like here's what i'm not sure about well, i'm not sure about a lot it, it, it just happened so i I've, I've only read it once but i'm just giving you my first impressions here it seemed like whether it was the point or just a byproduct a one result of that conversation just now is that haruaki seems to have been able to sort of break the programming so to speak if you get what I'm saying, like basically break through the mentality of Yasumizu and allowed Haru to, well, for one thing, properly mourn the death of her grandfather. That was that was a big that was a big part of what we just saw there. So, um, if if the traditions of of Yasumizu are what is right and correct, then by being evil. Haru is able to um, disregard that and properly express what she really feels. That's that's kind of what I got out of that. Now there was a whole lot more to that conversation. Um, I'm again, I'm not sure if that was the point of what Haruaki was doing there, what he was going for, just to try and break through that kind of mental conditioning she was under, or if that again that was just one part of it. Um, I, I'd have to go back through and reread it and try to understand it again. At least that that's what stuck out to me so far. Um, I don't know what the ultimate plan is. Go, he, he did earlier say that um, being a wolf doesn't seem to be the best role for finding out the truth. At least I think he said something like that. Again, I have to go back and check. But, um, yeah, I don't know if... I'm not sure if that, what that statement I just said is relates to the conversation he just had about being evil. Uh, I, there's there was a whole lot actually. There was just so much. Um, next time I think we're gonna have a bit of a extended opening because I that, there's a lot to digest and try to understand there. Um, <clears throat> in any case, I hope you're all doing well. I've been the warm. This has been Raging Loop, and I hope to see you next time.